UFC Heavyweight Showdown. about as decorated a kickboxer as has come into this division in some time, DC. And if we get a kickboxing match tonight, he ain't losing. He is a championship-level kickboxer, a guy that can stand in the pocket and trade and kick and punch with anyone. He's constantly throwing things from as close as you can get. He's comfortable throwing leg kicks. He will drive these into your body. But it's the aggressiveness and the ability and willingness to stand in the pocket and trade that makes him truly, truly special. I think that is what separates kickboxing, the high level, yep. from everyone else. He understands distance as well as any striker in this division. Of course, that is a byproduct of a lifetime of repetitions in the kickboxing space. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes. would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So more than 10 years apart, these two fighters, with some differences in height and a similar reach. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Bell Center in Montreal, Quebec, Canada! It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. It's first. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 169 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, Assassin. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. a big time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is going to be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big time athletes? Trying to establish that jab once again. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You got to like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. Perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Oh, man, his leg kicks are outstanding, and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see his opponent starting to slow down. He cannot take many of those kicks. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. 
Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. Three minutes to go in the round. Just missed with that right hand. Well, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Lee. And he landed the right hand there. Big kick. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Huge strike lands there, DC. He landed that massive shot. Now he needs to try to find the next shot, the follow-up shot that will finish the fight. Just unable to quite find that range. And they separate. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Straight punch lands. Oh, that's a pretty filthy combination there by Lee. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Oh, and there he goes working off that jab again. How's your jab? I mean, the jab's nice. I love throwing the jab. But you realize that as MMA evolves, guys... That is a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch landed. Huge block there. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Oh, tags him with the left. That left hand that is really effective. Oh, that is a huge shot there, DC. I'm not sure how he stayed up there. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talks to your toughness. Oh, nice jab. All right, so there's the end of the round, and the tide has officially turned a huge head strike to stun his opponent. We'll see which corner can adjust here moving forward. I mean, they've got to be celebrating. They've got to be happy. Everything's working. But the other side has to be concerned. They have to figure something out, make some sort of adjustment to try to change the tide of this fight. Such a fast leg kick. Good stick. Punch coming, it's blocked. Over and over, he's landed with big body kicks. Oh, oh what an attack. This fight's gonna be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with his opponent, thought he was going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Big body kicks land. Lee gets hit with a kick. That one appeared to land flush. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're going to have to put something on your opponent that's going to really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Nice loop and punch. Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the target. And they separate. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Great upper body movement defensively. Slips another strike there. And offensively, he hasn't been a world beater, but defensively, he's been strong tonight. And that has to cause frustration for the opponent, not being able to hit a guy that you want to really put away. But that's a testament to the head and the activity and the awareness of this fighter defensively. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two, much more aggressive than we saw in round one, and now starting to find himself in the pocket. Lee's got the tie clinch. Let's see what he can do with it. Shin slash foot right to the skull. You see why I'm a. Just digs his. 
Does not get to the target. Nice job defensively there by Lee. Oh, an educated jab there. I could watch this dude jab all day. I mean, he's so light on his feet, and when he pops that jab, it comes right back to his face. Kick right under that right elbow. What a round! So a big round for him there, DC. We'll go back and look at some of the highlights. Big knockdown for him. We'll see if he can follow it up. You could see that he was flowing. Everything was working in accordance to what he wanted it to be. And at the moment that it showed itself, the moment that the opportunity arrived, he jumped on it, got that big knockdown, and now he finds himself ahead in this fight. You ready? You ready? Third round underway. Nice leg kick land. Look at that leg. Oh, just misses with the kick. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really... Oh! Oh! There as he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got to hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Oh! Just a gorgeous shot there to end the fight. Really just the way he drew it up. He found the opening and capitalized on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight. All right, let's get you some replays now. Certainly a lot for our replay guys to work with in the truck. This was a clinic tonight in terms of mixed martial arts acumen in every realm of the game. A full-on display of all of his skills. He did everything in this championship winning performance. He used his wrestling. He used his elbows. He used his pace and pressure to really wear down his opponent so that he can get his hand raised. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve LeBing has called a stop to this contest at 1 minute 33 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by the count assassin. All right, so there he is.